Tonight, an urgent search for the person who shot a Statesville police officer. Officer Tyler Horn was released from the hospital and is expected to be okay, but officials still have not named a suspect. NBC Charlotte's Rachel Lumberg spoke with neighbors and police. She's joining us live. Rachel, what's the latest with this investigation? Well, Xavier, it's an active and ongoing investigation. We're still waiting to find out that suspect's name. The search does continue after the suspect shot at a police officer that was patrolling Fifth Street last night on foot. So, well, I guess somebody's shooting a Friday night special. That's what it sounds like. A gunman came out from the shadows, neighbors telling me from behind this tree, firing shots at Statesville police officers who were on foot patrolling 5th Street around 11 last night. I was inside watching TV and I just heard the pow, 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 pow like that and that was it. What'd you do? I went to the back door and looked out. I didn't see nobody nowhere, so I can't, you know, come on back in the house thinking that somebody's firing a gun. Robert wanted to protect his identity, but spoke about what he's been seeing lately. Do you ever see officers walking on foot? All the time. Like, so five this morning go through you. Robert says the last five or six months were welcomed peace until last night. Like I said, I hadn't heard any since the cops have been patrolling. I thought it was over. You know what I'm saying? I hadn't, it's been a while since I heard a gunfire. Statesville police officer Tyler Horn was hit in the back. Thankfully, the bulletproof vest did the job. Horn was treated and has already been released from Iredell Memorial. Uh, it don't make no sense the way stuff's going on over here. Dumb stuff. Well, the active search for the gunman continues right now. As soon as we learn new details on this investigation, we'll update you on WCNC.com. Reporting live tonight, I'm Rachel Lundberg for NBC Charlotte.